Negative events typically get all the media's attention. We wanted the NASBA Center for the Public Trust to have the inverse focus. We vowed to highlight the respectable, moral, fine, and selfless things people do. Simply stated, tell the good news. Annually, the Center for Public Trust chooses an individual to honor that has distinguished uh, themselves by demonstrating high standards of social responsibility, leadership, and good corporate citizenship. And we are so proud uh, that, that we can give this award to Michael Josephson. Uh, Character Counts is a tremendous uh, program throughout this country. They're caring for people. They have a concern for what happens in the corporate economy. And they're just doing right things. Michael's accomplishments and dedication to upholding ethics is unparalleled. Michael, on behalf of the Center for the Public Trust, thank you for being a difference. We appreciate you so much. So lucky to have here the friends, uh, uh, certainly all the people at the Institute who really do the work that, that, that I'm being honored for. And, and, and being recognized for is the things that are done by all of you who are working at the Institute. Uh, the, the concept of trust obviously is a concept that I think is central to, to what the Institute is about but what is ailing us you know, so much from a national point of view. I mean there isn't a, a, an ill we can trace right now that, that with all of its ramifications that are unwinding our economy and, and our society and even our educational system that can't be traced back to some shortcoming in one of these pillars. You know, whether it be responsibility or respect or, or trustworthiness and the like. And, and I'm, I'm delighted to be in the Army that, that's fighting the battle to restore a notion that trust can be attained. They chose an exemplary honoree this year. He works tirelessly to create programs and products that help people across the full spectrum of life to understand the importance of having a strong value and system to live by and to actually live by it everywhere all the time.